Good morning, astronaut. I'm Alexa Smells. And I'm Trinity Kirstead. Today is Monday, August 30th, and your Royville Television starts now. Hi, I'm Sarah Sumner. And I'm Mia Johnson, and this is your news. During Astro Hour, students will need to make sure to have a seat. If you are sitting in the lunchrooms, or go find a teacher's room to go to. This is a great time to see teachers for extra help, makeup work, study, or find a club to join. The date has been changed for our virtual open house to next Wednesday, September 8th at 6 p.m. It is very important that all of our families tune into this virtual event. More information will be given out as we get closer to next Wednesday. September 14th, 15th, and 16th will be FSA ELA retake, days for writing and reading. This will be for any 11th or 12th grader that has not met the reading and writing test graduation requirement. If you are testing, you will need to bring your own earbuds and all three sessions must be taken to receive a score. You must have a passing score of at least 350, which is a level 3, to meet the graduation requirement. September 21st and 22nd will be the Algebra 1 EOC retake days this fall. This is for any student that has taken Algebra 1 and has not met the math test graduation requirement. Both sessions must be taken to receive a score. A passing score is at least 497, which is a level 3. Today's club meetings during Astro Hour include FCA during the first half in Mr. Forbes' room, in room 725 and National Science Honor Society in Dr. Gay's room, room 533. The first Interact meeting is tomorrow, August 31st, first half of Astro Hour in Miss Redfern's office near the gym. Be there or be square. In sports, varsity football fell to U Galley 31-0 this past Friday. Congratulations to Madison Carr on getting third overall in the cross country meet this past Saturday. Here are some clips and pictures from football and cross country. We are starting a new segment every Monday called Meet the Students. Today we are meeting one of our seniors, Olivia McNally. My plans after high school is to go to college and then play college volleyball. My biggest advice for someone coming to high school would be to get involved and get involved in sports, clubs, activities, and all that stuff. Thank you for watching our show today. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is WeTV. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day, War Eagles.